Browning steps into a slant. It's broken up and incomplete. Jalen Johnson knocks it away. And this long Washington drive ends with a turnover on downs. Working on a second and ten here, Bruce. Browning looking wide side and a strong throw to Aaron Fuller who steps out of the tackle of Julian Blackman and turns it into a big play. 27 yards into Utah territory. Three receivers, a tight end and a running back to choose from and on the slant he finds Ty Jones who juggles. It is picked off. Boy that hit about four different players and ultimately Javelin Guidry picked it off and Utah takes over. Everyone else clears out in front of him. He does a good job of widening the defender and it again you can't throw that football any better. Heads up play by Gidry to get his hands on the football. Heads up play and Utah shows pressure. They bring a man off of the near side. Browning steps up. He tries to run for the first down and does to the 20. Fully extended for a gain of seven. Boy, this one much more manageable Bruce from 29. And finally some points in this Pac-12 championship as Henry knocks it through. From here be 53. Washington brings pressure and knocks him right out of Matt Gay's field goal range. Taylor Rapp, the safety. Yes, the safety with his team leading fifth sack. Here they empty it out for him. Washington brings pressure, floats one outside and hits his high school teammate Jalen Dixon. Breaks a tackle, crosses the 45, providing the biggest play of the night for the Utes, 26 yards. Shelly scans to the wide side. That ball struggled and picked. And headed the other way is Byron Murphy. A game-changing play. 66 yards to the house. Defense with the first touchdown tonight. The second interception of the night. And really, this is just unfortunate. SCOC Mariner somehow doesn't get that football in and there's Byron Murphy for his third interception of the season. A game changing play for the Huskies taking all the air out of this stadium for the Utah crowd. Hart Enos going to have a good career at Utah true freshman out of Phoenix Curtis Enos son. Here's a shot. Going back towards Enos, this time it is Miller getting the better of him for an interception. Put it on the freshman Peyton Henry to try and make this a two score game from 38 yards. It's blocked! The one phase where Utah figured it had a distinct advantage. Special teams. And this kick was lower than it needed to be, but it's tough to tell amongst that scrum the mess. I actually think it might have been John Penasini. Yep. Big number 52 gets a fingertip. Just enough. What a stop by the Utah defense. Can they find it late like they did against BYU last week? Shelley. Hit as he let it go. It's Murphy again. The third Washington pick tonight. Nice. And once Rapp's got a free run, Shelley knows he's going to take off. He ends up seeing Simpkins open downfield, but it's Byron Murphy who takes advantage of just an inaccurate football, inaccurate throw. And you wonder if Joe Tryon got a hand on it to affect that. Steps into one. Incomplete. And. Washington's going to head to the Rose Bowl for the first time since 2000. You had Byron Murphy making picks. You had guys making sacks. What impresses you most about this defense? I mean, they, they played really well today. We did just enough on offense to, you know, not give the ball away. We took care of the ball, and our defense, you know, had a hell of a game. It was pretty impressive. I saw you pacing up a storm over there on this last drive. What's going through your mind as you're watching all this? I mean, I don't know. What, I mean, our defense is really good, so I, I felt like we were in a good position, but... You know, even then, it's just, you know, you're always nervous. All right, it is time to give out the hardware 
to present the MVP trophy and the 2018 Pac-12 championship trophy. Ladies and gentlemen, the commissioner of the Pac-12, Larry Scott. It's been an incredible Pac-12 season. Congratulations to the Huskies and the Utes on not only great seasons, but a terrific football championship game. There's a bunch of people to thank that put on this event. The city of Santa Clara, San Francisco 49ers, Levi Stadium, and our presenting sponsor, 76. Everyone comes together to make this great stage for this terrific game. And the MVP goes to with two interceptions and the touchdown that won the game. Byron Murphy. Two big interceptions, one of them a pick six, the play to end the game. Byron, what's going through your head right now? I just knew coming into this game, the defense had to play big. Throughout the whole practice, this week of practice, defense a hard work a week. And I just want to thank God and thank my teammates for this opportunity. What are you thinking about what's next? Rose Bowl, baby. We ready to play. Rose Congratulations. Bowl. Let's go. Okay. Now, first I want to... I want to congratulate the uh, president of the University of Washington, Anamari Kause, athletics director Jen Cohen, and uh, to Coach Pete and the Huskies, the 2018 Pac-12 Championship Trophy. Coach, first and foremost, a game without an offensive touchdown. What can you say about this defensive battle here in Santa Clara tonight? One awesome job by that defense. We try to pride ourselves on being kind of an old school football team. We got an old school score. We'll take it any way we can get it. I'm proud of all these guys for battling hard all season. I'm proud of Husky Nation for showing up here tonight. We appreciate you guys.